As key and value tensors for earlier tokens in a sequence remain the same, they can be cached to avoid unnecessary computations. This KV cache can unfortunately balloon in longer texts, becoming a memory bottleneck that slows down inference. The good news is that new techniques have emerged to address this issue by reducing the number of keys and values. Let's look at multi-query attention or MQA first. Instead of each query head having its own key and value, all query heads share just a single key and value set. Since the KV cache size is a function of the dimensions of each head, MQA can shrink the cache size significantly. But there's a trade-off. By sharing a single key and value, model performance can suffer. The grouped query attention, or GQA, is a compromise. Instead of one shared key and value in MQA, it uses a small number of shared key and value sets called groups. Ideally, we want to shrink the KV cache without sacrificing performance. And that's where MLA comes in. MLA tackles this KV cache problem with a clever trick, compression. MLA compresses or down projects keys and values into a smaller low rank matrix. This compressed matrix is then up projected during the attention calculation. MLA requires a modified approach to address token position called decoupled rope. Standard rope encodes position by rotating query and key vectors. However, MLA's compression complicates this. With decoupled rope, instead of directly modifying the compressed key and values with position, separate dedicated query and key components are created specifically for position encoding. These position components are then combined with compressed key and value information before the attention calculation. In the end, MLA gives us faster inference and smaller memory usage. According to the DeepSeq paper, this approach maintains or even improves performance. Compressing the keys and values to a low rank representation apparently doesn't lose too much information and maybe even helps with generalization. I hope this walkthrough on attention was helpful. Thank you.